Hi, in this video we will see how to create GUI function in MATLAB to control server motor that is connected to our Arduino Mega. So here you can see that I have connected two server motors to my Arduino Mega. So these two server motors are, comes with my Seed Studio uh, support for Arduino. Let's see how to uh, create GUI function in MATLAB to run our servers. I have connected only two servers and if you want you can control if you want you can connect more servers to your Arduino Mega and make sure that you are connected uh, external power supply to your Arduino Mega if you are not uh, connected to your external power supply then your uh, then this program will not work for you go to and type guide choose a blank guy and I'm gonna use a slider for this. So two sliders to control my two servers. I'm going to save it as servers. So here we have our script to edit. So for that first you have to initialize your variables. I'm gonna clear all and then go and type a global variable. And this global variable is going to have the Arduino. So that's it. We have completed our uh, script to assign for the initialized status. Let's move on and uh, write the script for controlling our servos. So here our function slider one. Here go on and type any variable to get the data from the slider so the b uh, variable will be holding the data of slider and then assign the global variable this motor will be having the servo So connected uh, one of the server to the D2 pin. So that's it. Our program for to control our first server is over. I'm gonna copy this and paste it on my second servo slider so I'm going to change it as C and this is going to be server 1 D2 so everything has changed now let's see how this works I'm gonna run the script. So make sure you have changed all the changes. Uh, C and changes of our pin value after copying it. So I'm gonna check how it works. So here are two servers that are connected to our Arduino Mega. I'm gonna run the script now. Here's our cam. So let's test this.
and we'll test the other one Skin donor is moving. So that's it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching.